In this video, we will discuss why Chester County, Pennsylvania is the best place to retire in the whole United States. 10 reasons to convince you starting now. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Corinne Myers. I am a real estate agent with Keller Williams. I serve the greater Philly region, Chester County, Pennsylvania. And today I will be telling you why it is such a special place and why you should consider retiring here. You know, this is not just an opinion. I have facts and data to back this up. And I have 10 reasons that will tell you why this is a good option for you. But before I get started, I just wanted to say this. We're helping people all the time who are moving to or relocating within the Chester County and greater Philly region. If that's you, we'd love to help you too. So please reach out to me at the information you see on the screen. Make sure to ask for me, Corinne Myers, when you call. Also, don't forget to check out our website, themoregroupchester.com, to learn more about how we can help you and lots of other resources for you. Okay, let's get back to the info you came for. So where is Chester County in Pennsylvania? Well, it's about 45 minutes west of Philadelphia, so easy access into a major city, easy access to a lot of cities from here. And actually, Niche.com posted an article with 50 of the best places to live in PA, and Chester County is home to 12 of the 50 of the best places, including the number one spot, which is Chester Brook. And I'm gonna break down different areas throughout this video of Chester County to help you better understand what this area is all about. It has a lot of different qualities to offer. So let's get started with this list of the 10 reasons why Chester County is the best place to retire in the United States. Starting with number 10, the tax advantages. Chester County and Pennsylvania are very tax friendly. Traditional retirement income is not taxed, so things like your 401k, your IRA, pension, social security, and that makes PA one of two states in the entire country that does not tax that income, and it's the only state on the East Coast that does that. PA is a generous state when it comes to retirees' income, and on top of that, PA sale tax is a flat 6%. So from a financial perspective, this is a huge win for retirees. Number nine, it is very rich in history here in Chester County. It was founded in 1683 and was named for Chester, England, and it is one of the first counties established by William Penn. Chester County is home to the Valley Forge encampment where Washington led his troops. Now this park has been very well preserved. Many people go to enjoy it, the museums and exhibits there, and there are hundreds of miles of trails for biking, for walking, for running. There's 3,500 acres of monuments, meadows, and woodlands that commemorate the sacrifices and the perseverance of the Revolutionary War generation, and it really honors people from that time. Chester County was also one of the first and most important stops along the Underground Railroad. You'll find the Brandywine Battlefield in Chester County that is now a historic site and a beautiful park of 50 acres commemorating the largest land battle of the American Revolution, one of Washington's few Revolutionary War defeats. Okay, number eight. We have all four seasons here in Chester County. We don't have heat and humidity for nine months. We don't see many extreme climates. Yes, we get snow in the winter, but we don't have seven months of snow or anything crazy. We get all four seasons. So what that means is when you're tired of one, don't worry because right around the corner is the next season and something for you to look forward to. And the fall foliage here in Pennsylvania is beautiful. The month of October is just stunning. So you really get to enjoy all that this state and this county has to offer. Number seven, diverse population. All walks of life, all different people, faiths, beliefs, political systems, they all enjoy living here in Chester County. And that's really important for the quality of life that you'll find in this county in Pennsylvania. Now, a big factor in the diversity is that we have a little bit of everything here as far as rural farmland, rolling pastures, horse farms. It's a big equestrian area here in Chester County, but we also have more dense areas like Westchester, the city there. There's a giant university, Westchester University, if you're familiar, and that town is booming there. Phoenixville is a busy area, so you have some metro areas, some suburban, and also some more rural areas as well. Food and drink. Well, I hope you're hungry if you come to Chester County because 
You will not leave hungry. There are nearly a thousand restaurants in Chester County and they're all different. Mom and pop shops, a lot of love poured into these places and you can really tell. The restaurant scene here is ever evolving. Now, it offers a plenty of variety from Mediterranean to Japanese to traditional American. Restaurant weeks are always big in this community. Westchester specifically has a restaurant week and they even actually have a chili cook-off every year where they shut down a couple streets in the town and have a competition. So that's a fun thing to enjoy. Now, for drinks, Phoenixville is one of the busiest beer cities in the world. Downingtown, that's home to Victory Brewing, and there are plenty other of microbreweries in the area. Now, if wine is more your style, we also have plenty of options for you there as well. With nearly 300 wineries and over 14,000 acres of vineyards, Pennsylvania is actually the fifth largest wine producer in the country. Now, locally here in Chester County, the wineries coming up with amazing reviews and stunning views. And you'll have to check out the Brandywine Valley Wine Trail that is very fun and fully experience all the wine that Chester County has to offer. Number five for best reasons why you should retire here in Chester County, Pennsylvania. Attractions and entertainment. You will never be bored here. Longwood Gardens is claimed as one of the most stunning places on earth. It's located in Kennett Square, Pennsylvania, and it's home to more than a thousand acres of gardens and woodlands. You can explore the Rose Garden, the Orchid House, the Japanese Garden. There's a lot of history there as well and educational programs and events. Now, any time of year is the perfect time to see Longwood Gardens. If you go during the summer, you'll be, you'll be sure to get the fountain and fireworks display. If you go during winter and Christmas time and the holiday season, it is stunning as well and people are always taking pictures. Continuing with the outdoors, if you love staying active, we have two state parks here. We have Marsh Creek State Park and French Creek State Park, and they are home to thousands of acres of mountain biking, of trails, of water sports, whether you wanna go out on a kayak or a canoe or take a little boat out. Both of these state parks are well-maintained and well-preserved, and the community here loves them, and you'll always find events going on at those state parks as well. Kennett Square Mushroom Festival, that is another thing to check out. The mushroom capita of the world is Kennett Square. And honestly, you can kind of smell it when you drive by. But that is definitely a fun activity as a local to check out that festival. And a couple other quick things for entertainment and things to do. There's the Wharton Escherich Museum, which is a must see for any art enthusiast. And that's located in the beautiful countryside of Malvern. And that has the former studio of renowned artist and sculptor Wharton Escherich. And there's a rotating selection of temporary exhibitions. So always something new to see. And there's a book barn. If you love reading and books, Westchester, the heart of Chester County has Baldwin's Book Barn, and that is home to more than 100,000 books. And you may also run into a celebrity there because Oprah has been spotted there, Bill Clinton. They have anything from rare first editions to classic children's tales. Number four, proximity to other cities. This is a huge perk of living in Chester County, Pennsylvania. You could literally live in a farm in Chester County and commute to work into Philly. So think about that. You don't get that everywhere. As I mentioned earlier, you're 45 minutes to Philadelphia, 30 minutes to Delaware, only two hours to New York or Washington, D.C., and you're about an hour to Harrisburg, which is the state's capital. And Baltimore, Maryland, that's only an hour and a half away. And even though it's a landlocked state, it's a quick day trip to any beach on the East Coast if you want to go to Ocean City, Maryland, Avalon, New Jersey, or check out Rehoboth, Delaware. They're all within a couple hours. And that leads me to number three for the best reasons why Chester County is the best place to retire, accessible transportation. If you prefer not to drive, don't worry. There is an Amtrak train station that has a couple stops in Downingtown, Coatesville, Parksburg, in Chester County that can take you out to Philly, it's a quick trip, can take you up to New York or take you west to Lancaster, even all the way out to Pittsburgh. And if you have family or friends visiting from out of state, their best option for airport is the Philadelphia airport, which again, about 45 minutes or 30 miles away. So that's an easy major hub, lots of options for people to come in and visit. But you also have a couple other airports close by like Baltimore Washington Airport, that's about an hour and a half and the Newark Airport out of New Jersey, which is also about an hour and a half away. Number two, high earning income county. Data from the US Census Bureau shows that Chester County is the highest earning county 
in the entire state of Pennsylvania with an annual average household income of more than $100,000 a year. Now, that is 62% more than the state average and 59% more than the national average. So why is this important and how does that impact you? Well, strong financial health means lower bankruptcy rates and a stronger local economy. There's a lower unemployment rate. Education is a top priority here in Chester County. The schools are ranked some of the best in the state and the country. This all directly impacts your quality of life and the local economy. Speaking of quality of life, we are down to the number one reason, the top reason why Chester County is the best place for retirees, quality of life and world-class healthcare, second to none. I'm telling you, Chester County is ranked the healthiest county in the state of Pennsylvania and has remained in that top spot for many years. It is one of the first counties in the entire state to fund its own health department, which is extremely valuable. And living in Chester County, you have access to world-class healthcare. Chester County Hospital has been named to Newsweek's world's best hospital for a few years in a row, and other Penn Medicine hospitals are also honorable mentions. The Hospital University of Pennsylvania and Children's Hospital of Philadelphia is ranked the number four children's hospital in the world. The physical activity rate and the life expectancy rate are also significantly higher here in Chester County. Life expectancy is 81.4 years. The national average is 77.5. The national median for population with no health insurance is 11% and it's only 5.9% in Chester County. This all plays a role and results in positive outcomes for the quality of life, the economy, and just your life experience here in Chester County. Thank you so much for watching. Again, my name is Corinne Myers with Keller Williams, serving the Chester County area. I hope you enjoyed this video. We have plenty of other videos here on our channel for you to check out as well. So click the subscribe button and like our page and feel free to reach out to me anytime. As I mentioned, I would love to be a resource for you. Whatever your home needs are, if you have any other questions about anything, you can call or text me or email me. Don't be a stranger. Would love to get in touch with you. So have a great day. Thank you again for watching and we'll see you soon.